Well, season's fast approaching. June 1st is the official start of the Atlantic hurricane season, and if the prognostications are on point, we could be in for a long and active tropical season. Chief Meteorologist Phil Farrow is here now with a look at the numbers, Phil. Well, and today already we are looking at an area for possible development there by eastern Cuba. Fortunately, no worries for anyone, but that may not be the case as we head into the heart of hurricane season. I'd like to take a moment to remind you now is the time to prepare and stay prepared. Remember, it only takes one storm to devastate a community. The start of the 2024 Atlantic hurricane season is just over a week away, and forecasters are anticipating more storms than ever. This season is looking to be an extraordinary one in a number of ways. The National Atlantic Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, or NOAA, predicts 17 to 25 storms will form, with 8 to 13 of those becoming hurricanes, and out of those, four to seven could become major hurricanes. In all, NOAA anticipates an 85% chance of an above average season. These are the highest numbers they've ever predicted in a May outlook. As we head into Memorial Day weekend, officials say now is the time for South Floridians to prepare. One, stay informed. Two, be storm ready and three, make a plan. Officials urging residents to get their homes and families ready early. Trim your trees, now, don't wait. Prepare your storm shutters, make sure they work, now, don't wait. Have enough food and supplies on hand to keep your family safe for 72 hours after a storm has passed. But preparations go beyond just the home. Your cars need to be halfway full of fuel. For those of us that have electric vehicles, make sure that those electric vehicles are halfway charged. Those that are in need of, of medications, make sure you get a plenty, uh, a one month supply of medications. Staying prepared and up to date on the latest forecasts can help you stay safe this and every hurricane season. We have to be ready the same way every year, whether you're a new resident or an old resident like me. Uh, we know we need to be ready the same way every year because we are in a highly hurricane prone area. Our history alone tells us that. And for more tips on how to prepare, catch our special Surviving a Storm on Friday, May 31st at 7 p.m. right here on 7. I'll have your local forecasts coming up a little bit later on.